James Bradstreet Greenough, May 4, 1833, in Portland, Maine, October 11, 1901, was a classical scholar. Topic: Life. He graduated at Harvard in 1856, studied one year at the Harvard Law School, was admitted to the Michigan Bar and practiced in Marshall, Michigan, until 1865, when he was appointed tutor in Latin at Harvard. In 1873 he became assistant professor, and in 1883 professor of Latin, a post which he resigned hardly six weeks before his death at Cambridge, Massachusetts. Following the lead of Goodwin's Moods and Tenses 1860, he set himself to study Latin historical syntax, and in 1870 published Analysis of the Latin Subjunctive, a brief treatise, privately printed, and in many ways coinciding with Berthold Delbruck's Gebrauch des Conjunctives und Optatives in Sanskrit und Griechischen which, however, quite overshadowed the analysis. In 1872 appeared a Latin grammar for schools and colleges, founded on comparative grammar, by Joseph H. Allen and James B. Greeno, a work done with great critical care with Joseph Henry Allen. His theory of cum constructions is that adopted and developed by William Gardner Hale. In 1872–1880 Greeno offered the first courses in Sanskrit and comparative philology given at Harvard. His able scholarship was evident in his editing of the Allen and Greeno Latin series of textbooks. Also, he occasionally contributed to Harvard studies in classical philology, founded in 1889 and endowed at his instance by his own class, papers on Latin syntax, prosody and etymology, a subject on which he planned a long work on Roman archaeology and on Greek religion at the time of the New Comedy. He assisted in the founding of Radcliffe College. An able English scholar and an excellent etymologist, he collaborated with Professor George L. Kittredge on Words and Their Ways in English Speech 1901. He wrote light verse, including The Blackbirds, a comedietta, first published in the Atlantic Monthly volume XXXIX. 1877 the Rose and the Ring 1880, a pantomime adapted from William Makepeace Thackeray. The Queen of Hearts 1885, a dramatic fantasia. Old King Cole 1889, an operetta. Other publications Selections from the Poems of Ovid 1882. Select Orations of Cicero 1886.